hand. You're joking. I've got a bloke turning up to size up the back. One cab operator's license on his way. All them nights that Nan and Jean have been reciting the knowledge. Can't wait to tell Jean when she comes back to visit in Stacey. She won't believe it. I can't believe it. No more scrubbing filthy cars. Is. I've got a team that will do that for me. Right. I'm going to call Karen and let her know she's got a new boss. Karen. Jay part of the plan. She knows how to run the laundrette better than we do. And people love her around here. The last owner that tried to sack her, the Karen fan club turned up and he pinned up with pitchforks. All right, I'll lay her off and make you wear the tabard instead. What do you reckon? Last time you might be wear that thing. The old Bill turned up, didn't they? <laughs> That's our future in front of us. Tommy, Bert, Ernie, and Raymond as well. It's finally happening. You won't believe this. Just seen Dad and Cat with the keys to the laundrette. Now he can keep me out of his business, that's fine. But I was looking at Cat thinking, you mug. I mean, I'm so out of it, ain't I? Cat, are you on mute or something, babe? Yeah, uh, work calls. What do you mean, work called? I've just got your cross on. Sarge said they had some busy one last night. Some raid in Millwall. I've, I've got to go. But... Yeah, well, tell that Sarge I want my husband back by lunchtime. Are you sure that Fitzy's going to be up for seeing both of us? Yeah. Yeah, Ash said he's out of surgery and he's allowed visitors. All right. Well, I'll, I'll be there if you need me. We're. Thank you for agreeing to come with me. I, I couldn't have done this without you. And Ben? You spoke to him yet? One thing at a time, yeah? It's on the list. 